Hey guys, it's Kaylee here. I have a knife review for you guys today on two really great knives by CRKT. These are called the Free Range Hunter. They are a Russ Comer design. I've had these knives for just about a month now. I've gotten a lot of use out of them, um, and I have to say so far so good. They're really holding up well. I recently just used these to field dress and skin a deer, and I was really excited about that because I've actually been holding off as long as I possibly could on doing my review um, in hopes that I would get a deer so that I could uh, field dress and skin one and then let you guys know just how well these actually hold up. So I unfortunately didn't get the deer. My boyfriend did, but it's just as well that he got it because it still is putting food on the table, and I still got to eat some venison, so I was a happy girl. Um, and that was actually his first year that he's ever gotten, so I was really proud of him. I was excited. But anyways, I'll tell you my hunting story really quick. So him and I just recently got a two-man stand so we could hunt together. So we're out in our stand, and he actually fell asleep. So he was out cold, and I'm sitting there patiently waiting. And I thought I heard something. I figured it was probably a squirrel. But I look over, and there's a deer like 10 yards away from us. It was so close, I could have reached out and grabbed it. But I was so excited, and I wanted to get up and shoot it. But uh, like I said, that was his first deer he's ever gotten. I really wanted him to be able to get his first deer. I've been hunting since I was a little girl. I used to go out with my dad all the time. And I just recently got dug into hunting like two years ago, so he's fairly new to it. So I was really excited, and I really wanted him to get it. So I was like, get up, get up. So he stands up, first shot, it was a really clean, accurate shot. And it actually took it down right in its tracks. I was really surprised. That usually doesn't tend to happen very often. But anyways, he runs over to it, and he's yelling to me, come on, quick, come help me. He was so excited, and I was so excited, and I'm trying to scurry down the ladder stand as fast as I possibly can. And I was so excited and overwhelmed with excitement that I totally missed the last like four steps of the ladder stand and I just face bomb so hard into the ground and he turns around and he's like what are you doing come on and he looks over and I'm just like like face first into the ground it's hilarious and I get up and I'm like covered in dirt and mud and it was hilarious but anyways I was really proud of him and I was really excited that he actually got a deer because I have been dying to use these so we use this fixed blade to field dress it and then we use the lockback folder to skin it and I have to say I was so impressed with how well these held up um, they made it so much easier and I didn't have any issues at all whatsoever um, let's go over some specs really quick so first we'll start with the fixed blade the blade length is 4.25 inches or 108 millimeters the thickness is 0 0.135 inches or 3.4 millimeters. The overall length is 9.0625 inches or 230 millimeters. And the steel on this is 8CR13MOV stainless steel. As you can see, they both have a high hollow grind. And this is a clip point style. The other one is a drop point style. And the weight on the fixed blade is 3.6 ounces. It feels extremely lightweight, very comfortable. The handle is double injection molded, and it has both hard and soft polymers. So it's extremely grippy, which is great. It's ideal for any weather conditions. So even if it's raining outside or storming out, you're still going to get a really nice secure grip. Um, I love the finger grooves. Like I said, it makes it very comfortable. And then you get a little bit of jimping on top as well. So it just secures the grip a little bit more. Very comfortable. And then you have a little lanyard hole here. So if you want to put a lanyard on there. All right, and then it comes with a sheath. Let me grab it. This is a reinforced nylon fabric. As you can see, it has a little pouch in the front. So you can put whatever you'd like in there. I personally, I would recommend putting like a sharpening stone or something like that in there. And then you have a little snap on here. I'll show you guys. Just to uh, lock it into place secure it a little more as you can see snaps right in there it's not gonna go out at all on you so yeah I think that's pretty much all the information for the fixed blade oh I absolutely love the fixed blade super lightweight very comfortable and both of these came absolutely razor razor sharp all right so now let's go over the specs on the folder the blade length on the folder is 3.75 inches 95 millimeters. The thickness is 0 0.121 inches or 3.1 millimeters. The steel again is 8CR13MOV stainless steel. The handle length 
is 5.125 inches or 130 millimeters and the overall length is 8.875 inches or 225 millimeters and the weight on this is 4.5 ounces so this one's a little bit heavier than the fixed blade and the gut hook on this is insanely sharp works really really well like I said it made it so much easier to skin um, the deer it was it was insanely sharp so really it's just your personal preference what you like um, if you prefer if you use gut hooks often I'd say get one with a gut hook or you can do what I did and get one of each there's four different models let me see if I can grab this without knocking my camera over there's four different models to choose from as you guys can see so there's two fixed blades and then there's two folders and like I said one's with a gut hook and one is without a gut hook so it's really just your personal preference um, whatever you guys prefer or you can do like I said like I did get one of each <laughs> I'd say that's your best bet all right let's see again high hollow grind um, the handle material is the same let's see it is like I said a lock back and you have a little bit of jimping on the lock here as well so makes it easier to close and then you have the dual thumb set openers so it makes it nice and easy to get it open and it kind of tapers down as you guys can see too on the thumb studs there so you get a really nice grip thumb just fits in there good and it opens effortlessly um let's see I think that's pretty much it you got a lanyard hole on this as well so you can put a lanyard on there if you'd like I think I pretty much covered everything so yeah let's see this one comes with a sheath as well same material reinforced nylon fabric um, this has the belt carry system as well the option yeah these knives are absolutely amazing if you guys are looking for a really good reliable hunting knife I'd strongly recommend getting one of these um, they hold up so well and like I said so far so good um, I am not sure how well the edge is going to hold up I'll, I'll keep you guys posted because um, 8 CR 13 MOV stainless steel tends to not hold an edge as well um, but I'll let you guys know. I'll keep you posted. Like I said, I haven't had any issues so far. So I will definitely let you guys know. But yeah, I love CRKT products. They are amazing. Best customer service I've ever experienced out of any of the companies that I've ever dealt with. Um, they're amazing. And their products are excellent, really reasonable. Um, and they're, they're just great products. All around excellent company. I love CRKT. I'm sure you guys know that from all my reviews and stuff. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, I'm just rambling now. So one last look. Go over, check these out, pick one up. And uh, if you go over to CRKT's website, tell them that Kayla sent you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys soon. All right, take care.